Hello, if you run email marketing, then you should definitely watch this video because I'm going to show you two ways that you can generate email marketing scripts using chat GPT. The first way would be direct text and the second way would be to write HTML codes. Now for this video, I'm going to show you two examples of email marketing software. The first one is Vbout, which is a CRM and email marketing and automation software. The second one is Acuma Mail, which is another email marketing software. So I'm going to use ChatGPT now and the, the first thing that I would do is I'm going to pr uh, write a prompt which would be something like write an email marketing script for a family beach vacation. If you stop here then obviously ChatGPT would give you uh, and a text but that would be kind of not clear for you it will not be relevant so you need to give further information so I will say include keywords like summer summer getaway uh, five star family accommodations spa water sports or water activities kids entertainment etc now that my uh, prompt is very clear chat GPT would write the subject so I'm just gonna click on regenerate response so it is written the subject discover the ultimate summer getaway and you can see that it's writing everything and are you dreaming of the perfect summer vacation for your family? Look no further. We are thrilled to invite you, etc. At the hotel name or the resort name, we understand the importance of creating precious family memories. Uh, so it has clearly taken the keywords, five star accommodation, spa and wellness, endless water activities, kids entertainment, gourmet dining. I didn't mention dining, but still it has taken this. So don't miss this opportunity, uh, etc. So it will obviously give you, ask you was this response better or worse and you can uh, you can select these options, but I want to write something else. I wanted to write also write a conclusion paragraph or summary paragraph with a promo code summer. So obviously since this prompt is immediately after this the first prompt it will continue writing. Um, so let's see what it what the output is. As it, as it the uh, AI thinks, uh, don't forget as a valued subscriber, we have an exclusive offer for you. Book your family vacation using with us using the promo code SUMMER to unlock special discounts and additional perks, this limited offer, etc. Okay, now you can take this text and it has also given a subject. Now what I'm going to do is I'm also going to ask for a pre-header, write a pre-header for this email pre-header is the text which is immediately below the subject because it has given a subject over here so we want a pre-header for that so discover the ultimate summer getaway for your family at our five star beach resort promo code summer inside all right that's great so i'm just going to take this i'm going to copy it till here and the first tool that i'm going to show you is um, vbout it's going to create a template and design new template i'm going to use the new design builder and you can see over here the you have different drag and drop builder options over here text image button video divider spacer etc it also has html code which is the second option that we're going to see in this video countdown carousel etc so i'm just going to put this over here and this one below this, this this will be for the logo and the first one the second one would be text i'm just going to drop this i'm just going to paste this over here so space space and obviously you can even include a footer as well down i'm just going to close this and i'm just going to go to sections you have the footer element or image you can use from here but in the sections, they have some beautiful footers. You can see all the footer templates or sections that they have. All right, so I'm just going to use this one, for example. 
drop this just take this one so I think that I need to use the image for image first and then the right so add an image you can use the footer section over here all right so you can drag this draw down and that will be it right so this is the first way that you can do that and you can also test send a test email and that's it same with Acuma mail I'm gonna create a template and they have several templates over here so let me just take this test template and you can use the drag and drop builder over here as well uh, to add the text you see the drag and drop builder comes in over here I'm just gonna add the text over here and make some changes all right so this is the first way now most tools like um, like we bought Acuma mail or HubSpot will offer pre-formatted ready-to-go HTML templates that you saw just now that enable you to design emails without ever needing to access the actual code on the back end as you make changes in the front end email editor these changes automatically get coded into the final product so if i were to drag any element over here the divider or the video then obviously it will show in the front end but there's always a back end code to this email right but if you uh, but if you are comfortable let's say with html and you want more direct control over the code of your emails then most tools will allow you to directly add html codes as well so let's take a look first you have to uh, create a HTML code now we are not developers as digital marketing professionals we don't know how to do coding right but chat GPT will help you on that so I'm just going to take the same script or the same prompt so I'm just going to copy this but instead of writing this straight away I'm just going to write write an email marketing code or HTML code right and I've clearly mentioned HTML code so you can see that chat GPT is writing the HTML code over here so you can see all the styles all the endless what activities dive into the world this is the h2 tag this is the h2 this is the title tag all right so chat GPT gave an HTML code I'm just going to copy this code go back to Vbout, and let's say I'm going to delete this now I'm going to delete this and what I'm going to do is I'm going to use the HTML code over here and drag it all right so I'm gonna drag the HTML code. I'm just gonna delete this part to make it more clear okay this is the HTML code I'm gonna delete this and paste this code over here and save and close so you can see that the as soon as I added the code the text came over here all right now let's see what we can do with this uh, the entire HTML code is over here. Now I'll see if there's something called logo. No, there's nothing. So now it has reset. So earlier it was moving to the right, but now it is looking fine. So you can see everything over here. Right? Same with Acumba mail. Now I'm just going to delete this. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to just going to go back. Um, two templates create a new template my templates or create a new template rather import template and I'm going to paste HTML I'm going to write over here beach vacation and paste the HTML template here I will click on import so you will see over here the entire click on preview yep that's it over here All right government dining now you can make different changes to this code here you can also try adding another code over here 
and you can go back and make changes to the to the code here you can even align this to the left if you want all right you can move this to the left you can move this to the left although you have added using the HTML code you can still make these changes you can just click on all of this and align to the left and then you can add some more text over here that's not an issue so it's very straightforward very simple and you can also preview it how it looks in real time right you may not get exactly what you want over here because you you have to play around with the code sometimes you have to make sure that the code the you can check the cell spacing over here you can change the font color for example there's no font color given over here as you can see color you can change the color right and there's no text that this code has given right so that is the reason why it has only one line but you can expand over here so this is how you can use chat gpt to write emails text or even generate a html code using chat gpt it's very simple that's it for this video and i'll see you in the next one